everybody. Welcome back to another video about the building of Milan Recording Studios. Um, today, I'm very excited for what's inside of this box because it's super, super cool. And of course, since the video is titled The Building of Milan Recording Studios, what's in this box has something to do with a recording studio. And in fact, a recording studio can't really exist without an item of this type. Not this exact type, but something like this. I recently heard about a studio that had about a hundred of these things. Again, not a hundred of this exact type and brand of device, but this device. It's a microphone, and it's a very high-end one. So let's open up this box and check it out. I'm very, very excited. So, let's, let's do this. It's going to be cool. Let's open this one up first to add to the suspense and make you wait longer. Okay, it looks... I think I'm right. These look like the, uh, the shock mounts, I think. That looks like. the. I think the microphone would screw into here, and then I'm not really sure how all this works. I'm totally new to this type of microphone, so I, don't, I know you need the shock mounts for it to make it sound good but I don't know how it works yet, so that'll be fun to mess around with. Let me see if I can put this back in here without breaking. It feels very high quality, by the way. There we go. I think it just sits in there like that. Now, the moment you've been waiting for, I'm going to go put this way back. I'm back. Ooh, look, a wooden box. Whenever you open up something and you see a wooden box, you know it's going to be good. Okay, let's see here. Wow, that is fancy. Look at that. Oh, wow. I knew it came with a wooden box, but I didn't expect it to be that nice looking. It comes with a little uh, manual here. So, it's, it says on the side of the box here, TLM103. So that would be the model of the microphone. Whoa, look at it. How cool is that? It's just so neatly packaged, and it looks so nice. Whoa, this thing is heavy, too. It's extremely heavy for the size. That is so cool. I'm super, super excited to start using it. So this microphone here is a Neyman uh, TLM-103. It's a large diaphragm uh, condenser microphone, and it's supposed to have a really nice warm sound, which is the sound quality that I'm looking for in my recording studio. And I'm going to be using this and testing it out with all kinds of different stuff, and it's going to be so much fun. I can't wait. And it looks absolutely cool. I just like how it just looks sitting in here. It's really, it's really cool. And like I said, I'm very excited to start working with it and doing stuff. It's going to be so cool. Here's the microphone, and uh, it looks pretty cool. All right, so as you can see, we have the microphone set up. I'm kind of talking like to the side of the mic because we don't have a pop filter, and the pop filter basically reduces the popping noises that you get when you make like your P's and the B noises and stuff like that. So that's what I'm talking to the side, which you're gonna be getting a pop filter in the future, so I won't have to do that. But I really like the sound quality of the mic. I think it sounds really good and that's awesome. One thing though about the mic is that two of these prongs for the shock mounts, these two here, they were bent when we got them. And because I was trying to put it together, I was watching videos on YouTube for tutorials, it's actually pretty simple how it all goes together. It looks complicated, it's pretty simple. Um, but I was watching videos and trying to put it together, I was like, it doesn't look right, it doesn't want to fit together. So then I realized that these two were bent. We actually bent them back into the normal position with a pair of pliers, and it seems to be fine now. But it didn't happen during transit, the bended um, prongs. It happened before the item got shipped, because the box that the uh, shock mount was in was perfect. So that's not really good, but like I said, we fixed it, so that is good. But I'm super excited to work with this mic in the future. I think it sounds really good, and uh, it's going to be awesome. So make sure to stay tuned for that. Goodbye.